I want to give all honor and praise and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, double honor to the Apostle Great Millstone and Ruel, and salutation blessings to the hopefully elect pushing his words to sit in truth. Uh, this is your brother Pyro with a, with a quick video. Basically, man, it's just a, a video. Just I just want to thank the Most High and um, uh, and Yahweh Shai for uh, blessing us with the uh, apostles, man. Because more and more each day that you come to find out that, hey, man, we got the 100% truth, man. It's like uh, the the the, uh, uh, the apostle Ramla and uh, Elder Yashwama was saying like the uh, the the prophecies are speaking loud and clear, like it says in uh, Habakkuk the second chapter. It shall they shall speak and not lie, and it's speaking loud and clear, especially on the uh, RFID chip. Now, if it was a uh, a spiritual mark, then that would be speaking loud and clear that it's spiritual but all the uh evidence is pointing towards this chip that's physical that they're going to plant inside you i mean you got video after video after video saying that the uh, that they're going to implant this uh rfid chip that has your medical records your financial records uh uh all your information, your uh, driver's license, social security number, all that stuff is going to be planted inside a RFID chip to uh, to identify you, for they could track you, and for you to uh, deal in commerce. You're not going to be able to uh, buy or sell if you don't have that chip, because it's going it's going to trickle down to your uh, your, your jobs, your employers. They're going they're going to have the machine set up to scan your chip and whatnot to uh, to uh, identify that you work here and for your time, your hours. So when they put that money on your chip, it's going to go, it's going to, it's going to go through real simple, you know, and hopefully Lord willing, they start pushing it this year because they already tried it that, that three square market in, uh, uh, Wisconsin, they, they 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 did a trial run right there, and really people didn't uh, make it too much fuss about it. But as they go from when they start doing like government jobs, now that's when that's when the uproar gonna come up. That uh uh it's the uh, that's the mark of the beast and all that. So all you guys. That's uh, pushing that doctrine that it's a spiritual mark, it is Christianity and embargo and all this madness. You're gonna be found out to be liars, man. And the Lord gonna come after you, man, because because the scriptures is plain as day in, in uh, Revelation 13, uh, the 16, and 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 chapter 14 of Revelation tell you if you take that mark, you're gonna be destroyed. So. All this playing around and acting like you don't know when the Lord is showing you through his prophecy what time it is, what it is, what it's no it's no mistake. It's the RFID chip. And if you get that mark, you're gonna be destroyed. It's just that simple. And I tell people all the time, but I don't get I'm like I don't give a damn if you uh take heed or not. I'm just wiping the blood off my hands with your ass, straight up. When you take that damn chip, it's on you. You 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 asked out, and a lot of a lot of people gonna take it because they they don't have faith for one, and then they wanna um eat. You know, when time get hard, people gonna do whatever it takes to to uh to find comfort. You know, don't nobody wanna suffer. Everybody just wanna um. Have fun and eat your eat your hot Cheetos and play your video games and and come to your little nice houses and all that. People don't want that to be interrupted. So when they when they uh roll out this chip for us on your jobs and all that, people gonna get get in line and take it. They don't want they ain't gonna just leave their job knowing they got uh mortgage payments to pay, car notes to pay. They ain't gonna do it. Because they wrapped up into this world, 
And this is how Satan got uh, the majority of our people in a trick bag. They got them in that trick bag, and they, you know, they so carnal that they ain't giving it up. You, you got, you got people that won't even give up a simple thing as eating pork. That'll let you know that they taking the chip. If they can't get, if you can't give up pork, what makes you think you just gonna give up uh, your job? <laughs> so it's just little simple things like that. The Lord already know if you're not gonna adhere to His law, such as the commandments. You're not going to be prepared to not take that mark. And that's the final test of this whole thing. This is how he's going to find out, uh, uh, do you have faith or not? And all he asks is, do you have faith as a mustard seed? But a lot, a lot of people don't don't have the, the faith of that. You know, they've been in America too long, and they used to having things go a certain way. And they don't want no adversity and nothing to disrupt their lives on how it's going right now. So, woe unto them that, that trust in Egypt, which is America, you know. So, just a quick video, man. It was on my mind. I've been uh, watching videos, watching uh, Apostle Tahar, Apostle Aramla, Apostle Gabor, you know, and all the other Akim out there. I'll be watching the videos. And being on this plantation, working a lot, sometimes it's hard to get it in, but I got to get it in because there ain't no excuse. You know, you got to stand up on your watch. So with that, I hope that was edifying. Hope hope the Akim got something out of that, that this Mark of the Beast is getting is about to get pushed real heavy, man. And in 2019, I think it's going to be a real... Uh, topsy turvy year, man. A lot of shit going gonna go down because a lot of shit went down in, in, in 2018, and it ain't even over yet. We still got like 10, 9, uh, 10, 11 days left, so it's about to be on and cracking. So all the brothers that's in the know, it's pushing this true doctrine. Uh, keep the faith, stay strong. We almost out of here. And we're going to get delivered someday. And then we're going to get to laugh and, and, and talk about this for for eons on eons. So with that, I want to give all praise to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, the Abbasid the Apostle, Great Millstone, the Ruel, and salutation blessings to the Hope elect. And with that, I'm going to say Shalom.